The next practice is something I hope you'll do a lot. And I call it the saying no practice. Some of you know this practice, I think, already. And I think of it as a sacred practice. I have noticed that a lot of people in our culture have a very hard time saying no at all and saying no to uses of their time that don't feel good. And what I teach is that you feel in your body when someone wants you to do something and you don't have to do it, it's not required. There's a way out of it. And now I hope you are, as you're listening to this, thinking with me about the many instances where you have a choice. And I want you to feel, we're not gonna do a guided meditation. I just want you to be feeling and remembering times that you have said yes to a use of your time that felt like hell, it did not feel good, or it, maybe you wouldn't call it like hell, but it made you really uncomfortable and you did not like it. You didn't like saying yes when you really wanted to say no. There are very many times that you do not owe anyone an explanation and it is simply socially more acceptable to say yes. 